Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is my XR Pro Mongoose. And um, I could say that this is the second stage of upgrades on this bike. Because the way I had it before was the, the original wheels, uh, the stock wheels and uh, different tires. But I used the, the WTBs and they were pretty heavy. So the bike was pretty heavy and uh, got me really tired on uh, on the trails. So I decided to go with this Vuelta Starlights uh, and the Victoria Mesco on the front and the back, the 2.5 on the front and 2.5 on the back, just to save weight and I, I saved a ton of weight. The bike became a 32 pounder and I'm pretty happy with it because it's a pretty fast bike. Also I had, uh, early on I had a little problems with, with the upgrades that I had. I had an NX crank set and I don't know if it was a pedal strike or what, but I stripped it. And for s some way, somehow I saw on eBay, some of them uh, selling and stripped it too. And also on uh, Facebook market. So I think it's a problem with the alloy of the NX crank. It could be just me, but you know. Also, uh, I changed the cassette, but that was my fault. I bet the cassette trying to remove it. I had to remove to put in another another set of wheels and unfortunately I uh, I kind of bent the cassette so I, I got the, the new one this is a I don't, I don't remember the, the brand but it's, it's pretty cheap I don't know it's like 80 bucks I forgot the name of the brand it was the only one available it was hard to find I have a 11 to 50 cuss, uh, uh, 11 to 50 11 speed cassette so it was pretty hard to find you know, it's pandemic, it's it's kind of crazy to find uh, find parts, um, especially in level speed. So yeah, uh, I also had a problem with the shifter. I had a GX grip shifter first, and uh, one hard ride, and that thing was gone. So I got the NX trigger shifter, and it's crazy good. It's super quick. It's super smooth. The bike shifts super smooth and super quick too you keep click once twice and you know it just goes down like crazy it's, it's so good i'm very happy with uh, how, how the bike turned out uh, for the weight for 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 the looks i think the bike looks great i uh at the trails everybody I, I, there's always somebody that stopped and asked you know they can't even believe, believe that it's a mongoose um so yeah, I think I, I I did a great job. Right now I'm, I stole the the seat post and the seat from the Schwinn. That is uh, some upgrades coming for the Schwinn. So uh, if you guys saw my Schwinn Tef, well, it, it's I got a new fork for it, new headset. So uh, you will we will see. And this is it, guys. This is my Mongoose XR Pro. If you guys have any questions, leave the comments. Hopefully the uh, YouTube will allow the comments uh, because I don't know they didn't allow my last video, but my last video was kind of cre uh, kind of bad, so it's what it is. If you guys wanna take a closer look, it's running a 120 millimeter Apex on the front, 100 millimeter radon for the rear. NX 11, 11 speed derailleur, SX crank set with a 30, 32 ch uh, a chain ring, a eagle. Also the MT200 hydraulic brakes, great brakes for this bike. The handlebar is a uh, race face FX. Also uh, the stem and the, the headset is a FSA. this is it thank you very much guys leave a comment leave a like and we'll see you next time